We've seen it on the way up. And I'm hearing a story about an elephant in marriage. Actually, someone put on Facebook last night they'd seen an elephant on the back of a truck. I don't know. No idea. It's just turned up. It's, I would imagine it's a country arts project. It, it makes me think, like, it's kind of a bit sad and... What, what what happened to cause all these accidents? Uh, it's the elephant in the it's the elephant in the room, isn't it? Death rate in Wheatbelt WA is devastating. It's uh, 11 times more than the Perth rate. It's not something that people in the Wheatbelt talk about often. We want that conversation to start now. So, and that's why we've introduced this elephant in the Wheatbelt, which signifies the elephant in the room. We want people to have a conversation about this terrible issue that's taking so many lives in Wheatbelt, Western Australia. I don't think people understand that it just doesn't affect the community that we live in here. It, it affects a whole wide range of a community. It is tough when you're going out to someone and um, um, you might have to cut this for a minute. <laughs> um, you know that you're probably the last person hanging on to their hand. Um, can we just... Okay. <laughs> We're hoping the elephant will get people talking about it, talk about road deaths in, in regional WA, but also about serious injuries. They're just as devastating. I've lived in the wheat belt in Western Australia. I've been to far too many funerals, and I know that everyone who lives in the wheat belt has as well. And what we're asking drivers to do is firstly, start the conversation in your community. Talk to those you care about. So do that, become more aware about your own behaviours and attitudes about driving. Secondly, invest in safer vehicles. A four and five star car can really save your life. Thirdly, we're calling on the state government to support the initiative. The police through traffic enforcement to make a greater effort because we know that enforcement alters driver behaviour and ultimately that will also save lives. And so we're asking for all of those things. If people can only do one thing, that is buckle up, wear your seatbelt. One in three people killed in the wheat belt aren't wearing a seatbelt. And, you know, it takes a moment to buckle up, but it could save a lifetime of regret. Today we heard about an elephant that comes to town and he's been around the neighbourhood. He's got people talking. Thank you, big elephant. RAC. For the better.